guys happy vlogmas day 17 <laughs> um, I'm trying to I'm trying to cheer you up because it's Monday morning but anyways I am actually very excited because today's video I am partnering with iHerb to bring you a highly requested video and that is my skincare favorites and top skincare recommendations of skincare products that I buy on iHerb if you have been watching my channel at all or seen any of my vlogs or, or, or haul videos, you know I have a little bit of a habit when it comes to shopping on iHerb. Probably shop there every other week. Um, I probably order something from there every other week, whether it be skincare, uh, food, snacks. They have a variety of different vegan foods. It's really easy to, for me to identify vegan snacks. Um, they make everything uh, clearly labeled. They also have household items, cleaning supplies, pet supplies, and baby supplies, which I obviously don't buy, but they have that. Um, if you're not familiar with iHerb, they are a global leader in uh, bringing the best overall value of natural products to their customers. They serve customers in over 150 different countries, which is one of the other reasons that I really love iHerb is that I know many of you watch me from other countries. You frequently ask if I can recommend skincare products that are available to you in your country. So iHerb allows me to do that, given that they ship to you over 150 different countries worldwide. They offer free to discounted shipping to, um, to over 150 different countries. It's really easy <laughs> to get to free shipping on iHerb. So it's nice in that manner. And they offer a triple guarantee on their shopping experience. And what that means is, first of all, they offer a value guarantee. They guarantee the best overall value of over 30,000 different natural brands, uh, natural brand products. And like I said, you can buy anything from food, snacks, baby items, and of course, skincare. And second, the second guarantee is they guarantee quality. They are a California-based superstore and they guarantee that all of their products are authentic products that are sold in the United States. Some of these concerns you guys asked me about in the comments, like how do I know I'm not getting a counterfeit product? iHerb guarantees authenticity of all of their products. The other thing that's nice about their quality guarantee is that their products come shipped directly from their temperature controlled warehouse. So you don't have to worry that your products were sitting out in a hot, sweaty uh, warehouse or truck, truck bed. Um, so that's wonderful, particularly when it comes to sunscreens, chemical filters and sunscreens we know can degrade. And that is a concern that, that many people have. How, how are the products getting to them and are they left on a hard car? iHerb eliminates that concern, which is fantastic. And third, they have a delivery guarantee. No excuses. They, like I said, they offer free to discounted uh, shipping to over 150 different countries worldwide. I cannot say enough good things, honest to goodness, about their about their shipping. It is super reliable. Um, you know, it's like it's like clockwork. I place the order. I usually end up ordering late at night, and I know exactly, almost to the second, that it's going to be delivered. They never have let me down as far as as far as their delivery, not once. And I shop there an awful lot. <laughs> um, so I love iHerb, and it makes logical sense for me to partner with them, and I'm really excited for the opportunity. With that, I'm going to get into all my skincare favorites that I buy on iHerb. In my recent skincare routine, I got a lot of questions about what hand soap I use to wash my hands. And I buy my hand soap on iHerb. It is the seventh generation free and clear uh, soap. I love this hand soap. It's fragrance free. It is very gentle. I have to wash my hands so many times during the day because of my occupation. And I don't find this soap, this soap does not dry out my hands whatsoever. It uh, is cruelty-free, which I know many of you seek out exclusively cruelty-free items. That's the nice thing about iHerb is that you can you can look and they will they will tell you the cruelty-free or not status on their products, so you don't have to guess, second guess, or contact contact the company. iHerb does that for you, which is fantastic. Yeah, so I really love this hand soap. I use it to wash my hands before I take out my contact lenses, before I take off my mascara. And I never have any problems with irritation on my eyes or my hands from using this and you know transferring to my hands. You guys know I cook a lot. I'm always chopping up vegetables and garlic. 
and then in the evening I take my contact lenses out and this does a nice job of gently removing those, those food irritants and allergens uh, so I don't transfer them to my eyes when I take my contact lenses out. All right, and then next up, if you have watched any of my skincare routines, this should come as no surprise to you. Um, I love CeraVe products, and you can buy them on iHerb, so that's fantastic. They are fragrance-free, and um, so one that I use and love and strongly recommend, I use this to my face and my body as a moisturizer, is the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream. This has the eczema association seal of approval it is free of fragrance it has ceramides in it so it is very helpful in restoring the skin barrier it is very helpful in restoring the skin barrier helping the skin barrier to restore itself it can be used on the face the body so it is it is a all-in-one all-in-one moisturizer I love it and check out my skincare routine I talk about how I use it in that video also in that video, I talk about another CeraVe favorite, that is the Hydrating Facial Cleanser. You can also buy this on iHerb. Um, after I wash my hands with that uh, fragrance-free seventh generation hand soap at night, this is, this is what I use in the evening to wash off my makeup, as you, my mascara and my sunscreen, as you saw in my skincare routine. This is fragrance-free, it's very gentle. You can use it around your eyes, uh, just don't get it in your eyes. So for me, that means closing my eyes when I wash off my, my mascara, but oh, this is wonderful and probably one of my favorite favorite cleansers out there. And then the third CeraVe product that I can't live without and is in, in pretty much every single skincare routine I've ever shared with you guys, it is the CeraVe Healing Ointment. This, I'll just show you up close. This is a nice, thick, fragrance-free, multifunctional emollient ointment. It's very occlusive. And this is fantastic on your lips. It is a lip saver. <laughs> it should. This could be renamed Lip Saver. This has uh, saved my lips so many times during the winter. It's great on dry, cracked lips. You can also put it um, on your face if you want a really, really, really kind of industrial strength moisturizer. It works well in that manner. You can put it on your heels for dry, cracked heels. Uh, your elbows works wonderfully there. Um, strongly recommend this. It is petrolatum and it also contains ceramide. So this will really kickstart repair of dried, cracked skin. Uh, it is a winter. It is a winter skincare must. But for me, it is a skincare must. I I can't live without this. Um, I keep it with me everywhere. I have several bottles of it. So this is a, a must have. All right, then the next brand of skincare that I like to buy on iHerb is Neutrogena. You guys know I'm a huge fan of Neutrogena. iHerb carries many of Neutrogena's products, including uh, sunscreens that I love from Neutrogena that are fragrance-free. First one is the Neutrogena Pure and Free Liquid Sunscreen Broad Spectrum SPF 50. This is a liquid sunscreen that you want to shake up first. I reviewed this for you guys, I believe in my Oily Skincare SPF video. Um, it's a liquid sunscreen that is mineral exclusive. This is a very sensitive skin friendly, um, very sensitive skin friendly um, sunscreen. This will not sting or burn around the eyes. It is, it is mineral exclusive, so it has zinc and titanium dioxide. Excellent UVB, UVA protection. And because it's in a liquid, a light lotion liquid vehicle, but as you can see, it's in a nice light lotion liquidy vehicle. Um, it does leave a little bit of a cast, which dries down pretty matte. This is wonderful under, underneath makeups and cosmetics. Um, will not peel up underneath your underneath your foundations and things. See, it does have a little bit of a white cast, but with air exposure, that dries down to a matte. And it's a wonderful sunscreen, great for sensitive skin, great for oily prone skin, very uh, rosacea friendly, very eczema friendly. It's a good one. Then another uh, Neutrogena product that I love and have shared with you guys in my skincare routine for mature skin is the Neutrogena Ageless Intensives Anti-Wrinkle Deep Wrinkle Night Moisturizer. This is a nighttime moisturizer with retinol in it. So for those of you who can't get uh, tretinoin um, and are motivated to use a, a cosmeceutical retinol, 
This one is wonderful. I, like I said in my retinol videos, I can't speak to the efficacy of retinols. As I've said in those videos, they require your skin to perform an additional step on the retinol to get it to its active state. They do appear to be somewhat helpful though. Um, in addition to this containing retinol, however, it is a wonderful, wonderful nighttime moisturizer and very gentle, does not sting, not irritating whatsoever. But check out my skincare routine video for mature skin. I featured this product in that video. It is, it's a great one, very easy to tolerate, wonderful moisturizer. If anything, I strongly recommend it. Um, but uh, moving along to kind of cruelty-free vegan skincare, one that you guys know I love is a face wash by Earth Science. It is their Ceramedics Earth Science um, Extra Gentle Cleanser. This is, like all skincare products I love, fragrance-free. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's fragrance-free. This is, this is a cruelty-free vegan version of the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser that I shared with you guys. This is wonderful, super gentle, dry skin friendly, rosacea friendly, oily skin friendly. This does a very good job of taking off water resistant sunscreen. Um, I love this product and it is one of my favorites, favorite cleansers. It's cruelty-free, it's vegan, and it's also gluten-free as well. So it is, it's a great cleanser and I don't have anything bad to say about it. Strongly recommend it. They also have a corresponding body moisturizer that is fantastic. I have it here. I have reviewed this as well as the cleanser um, in, a, in, a, in a video review of this brand for you guys. So check that out, but can't say enough good things about this. This, like their cleanser, um, they both contain plant-derived ceramides, so they're really great for kickstarting the, the skin barrier repair process. And this one is very thick and very moisturizing, this cream. So it is a great head to toe moisturizer. Just like CeraVe, CeraVe moisturizing cream in the tub, this likewise can be used in that same way. Face, body, back, feet, you name it, head to toe um, and fragrance free. So it's great, for, it's great for everyone in the entire family, honestly. But next up in the vegan, cruelty-free realm of things is the Derma-E Natural Mineral Sunscreen SPF 30. This is non-nano sized, here can you guys see? This is non-nano zinc um, only sunscreen that is broad spectrum and will give you good UVA, UVB protection. Um, this is Hawaii friendly, so Hawaii has banned several of the fil chemical filters. This one is safe there, it is coral reef friendly. Because this is non-nano sized zinc, however, it does have a pretty significant white cast associated with it that does not necessarily dry down particularly matte. So be prepared for that, but it offers very good, reliable protection and is, and is very echo, echo-centric in that it is, it is mineral only, it does not contain filters which potentially could harm the reef. All right, and then next up is the Fruit of the Earth Aloe Vera 100% Aloe Gel. I get questions all of the time, can I recommend good aloe products? And this has to be one of my favorites in that it is just aloe vera gel. It doesn't have any added fragrance in it, which is can be really difficult to find. This is cruelty free and aloe, so vegan. I mean, aloe is a plant. Um, and no animal testing, cruelty free, wonderful. I really like this product a lot. But aloe vera gel has some wonderful humecta properties. It has a lot of natural anti-inflammatory compounds in it. Uh, and it has been shown to be helpful for not only dry skin, but also for um, psoriasis. So this is a very wonderful humectant. You can put this underneath your moisturizer if you want uh, to kind of add a little bit of extra extra hydration in your skin. It will it will help hold on to water in that it is a humectant, and it's it's pretty it's very easy to tolerate. Some people are irritated by aloe, so if that's you, then avoid this. So you all know I'm not a makeup wearer, but I do wear tinted sunscreens. I've reviewed for you guys. Uh, tinted uh, mineral powders as well. So just to reiterate, I'll link the video down below for you guys, but I do really like the Physician's Formula products. They sell them on iHerb as well. Um, this is, uh, I believe, SPF 30, I wanna say. Um, I have, mine is in the color Light Clair. It is mineral only uh, BB cream, so no chemical filters, and also has iron oxides for protection against some of that uh, blue light that can contribute to hyperpigmentation. 
So this is a good everyday BB cream. I recommend it um, and check out my review of it to see how it goes on more in depth, but it is a good one. One thing that people find helpful in terms of complying with sunscreen is they have a real problem with the shininess that sunscreen can kind of leave, the kind of oily appearance. And one thing that can be helpful is after you apply your sunscreen, you can kind of mat, mattify it with a, a mineral sunscreen powder. And I've reviewed um, others before, and one that I have reviewed and really enjoy and recommend to you guys is the Physician's Formula uh, Mineral Wear Airbrushing Loose Powder. Um, so I also reviewed that in my Physician's Formula review. So I will list that video down below for you guys. Oops. <laughs> so you can see how, how it goes on. Uh, but it it does the job really nicely. It's also helpful uh, to dust it in your, in your on your part for a little extra sunscreen on your scalp line. Uh, it can be really hard to use sunscreen on the scalp and the hair. Sunscreens can be drying. Um, and this, uh, dust it on the part line, can be, can be really nice that way. So I recommend that one. It is a good one, very affordable. And I have struggled to find deodorants that are, quote, all natural, aluminum free, that work. Um, I have videos on deodorants and my thoughts on deodorants and my deodorant Q&A and for the most part natural deodorants are not actually a very effective antiperspirants. Um, but I have had good success with the Crystal Body Deodorant Natural Protection. For those of you who um, are avoiding aluminum or who find aluminum containing deodorants are very irritating um, and bothersome to you, I recommend giving this a whirl. It is cruelty free and I'm assuming this one's vegan. Its only ingredient is potassium alum, which is a salt. Okay, it looks like those cool, it looks like one of those cool salt lamps. It's, it's just like a, like a salt, a salt stick. <laughs> um, it's really handy to take with you in your bag and on the go. But the way that this is effective is if you're somebody who actively perspires a lot during the day, as soon as you start feeling damp, swatch a little of this over the damp area. And what that will do is help wick up that extra sweat because when that sweat stays on your skin, your, the bacteria that normally live on your skin start to break it down and that's what leads to body odor. And this will nip that in the butt and it's really easy to take with you. Uh, it's gentle enough because it does not contain aluminum. Aluminum can be irritating. It's gentle enough that you know you, you um, can tolerate doing this several times a day if you're, if you're really hot and sweaty. And honestly, even though it's winter time, when you're wearing those heavy coats and you happen to go indoors for a short period of time, they've got the heater cranked up, you don't quite have time to take off your coat and sweater and everything, you can get a little sweaty under the armpits. So it's nice to have this in your bag to kind of mop that up and go on your way. Um, and it does not stain your, it won't stain your, your sweater clothing either. So that's great. Um, so I really recommend this one. It's the only natural deodorant that I have found that is effective even remotely and does not contain irritating essential oils. The other thing that I love about iHerb skincare is that you can actually go into not only the skincare but also the makeup section of their site and search for K-Beauty. They have tons of K-Beauty brands, Korean skincare brands, which you all ask me to review all the time. And if it weren't for iHerb, I would have a really hard time locating some of these. They carry many, many, many great K-Beauty brands. And one brand that I love, many of their products and recommend to you guys, is CauseRx. Um, you know I'm a huge fan of the CauseRx Ultimate Nourishing Rice Overnight Spa Mask. This is a wonderful light lotion. I use this as my nighttime facial moisturizer this summer, um, and it is wonderful. This really brightens up your skin. It contains niacinamide, and I definitely see a brightening effect when I use this. It's oily skin friendly. It's sensitive skin friendly. Um, I can't say enough good things about this particular um, moisturizer for the face. It has uh, rice extract, which is a wonderful humectant. Uh, this is great. I use this in the summer. It's almost out. Um, this is like my second or third bottle of it. I love it, um, and it's a great one. I also strongly recommend their PHA Moisturize, Moisture Renewal Power Cream. Here, I'll hold the, hold the box up for you guys. Their Moisture Renewal Power Cream. but 
It's one of those that has a little scoopy doodle. It's a nice uh, moisturizing cream. This particular jar of it, I'm almost out of, but I have a new one there. Um, and so I'll just scoop out the last little remains of it so that you guys can see. Yeah, it's a nice It's a nice light moisturizing cream. It's a little bit heavier than the Cosrx here. I'm going to go go sit back down. It's a little bit heavier than the Cosrx nourishing nourishing rice overnight spa mask, but this has polyhydroxy acids in it, things like gluconolactones. If you recall back to my alpha hydroxy acid video, I talked a little bit about polyhydroxy acids. They are excellent humectants and moisturizers. They help to bring water into the epidermis. And they also very, very, very gently, even more gently than, than alpha hydroxy acids, uh, exfoliate the skin, kind of one cell at a time in a very, very gentle manner. Of all exfoliants out there, polyhydroxy acids are probably the most rosacea friendly. So this is a wonderful product for people with sensitive skin who have some kind of dull, dry, patchy areas that they want to uh, kind of gently, gently soften. This is fantastic. Then some other K-Beauty products that I am a huge fan of are the Etude House Soon Jung um, line. These are wonderful products. They are fragrance free. They have um, green tea in them. Um, and I really love their Mild Defense Sun Cream. This is one of the only K-Beauty sunscreens that I have found that is not, does not contain fragrance. This is a mineral only sunscreen. It also has green tea polyphenol in it, so that's wonderful in that, you know, theoretically it can scavenge free radicals, help be helpful for pores. Um, it's a great, it's a great sunscreen. Um, within that line, they also make a cleanser that I reviewed for you guys and I rather enjoy the uh, pH 6.5 whip cleanser. This is an, a foam, a foaming whip cleanser here. I'll just put it out. It comes out almost like shaving cream. Woo! <laughs> Isn't that fun? Um, fragrance free, very easy to tolerate, takes off your makeup nicely and doesn't leave that dry residual. Like I just put it, I just put it here on my hand and rubbed it in and it doesn't even feel like I have cleanser or soap on there. Um, I will, I will rinse that off in a bit, but, <laughs> and I certainly can't skip over the Sun Young uh, 2x intensive barrier cream. I have talked about this um, at length in my videos. I really love this. This is a green tea containing, um, and I believe ceramide as well, containing moisturizer. That is wonderful, uh, and I strongly recommend it. The Soon Jung um, products are great, and I recommend them. Uh, Etude House. And then lastly, I have been getting questions from you guys, what shampoo am I using? And lately I've been using a shampoo probably over the past three or four months from iHerb that I'm loving. I'm a little nervous to talk about it because it does contain fragrance and you guys know I'm always pushing you to make every effort possible to avoid fragrance, but I love fragrance in my shampoos and um, you know I live on the edge in that regard. So the shampoo that I have really been loving is the Attitude Super Leave Science Natural Shampoo. This has a nice cranberry scent. This, is, this shampoo does not leave any residual on my hair. It doesn't weigh down the hair shafts. I notice that my hair is a lot shinier and it just has a just has a radiance to it when I shampoo my hair with this. It doesn't leave us any kind of scalp buildup. It is wonderful. They also make a fragrance-free baby uh, wash and shampoo that I have not tried, but if you need to, a fragrance, if you absolutely need a fragrance-free shampoo, I would try that one because I've been happy with everything attitude that I've had. So yeah, those are my top skincare products from iHerb that I recommend. I know I'm leaving a bunch of them off. There are just so many, I can't, it's within the con constraints of the video, I can't go over every single one, but these I have reviewed for you guys and consistently use in my skincare routine, so you'll see them time and time again. Um, and I can't say enough good things about shopping on iHerb. I mean, outside of being sponsored in this video, you know I genuinely love iHerb. I buy tons of stuff on there. I have a little bit of a habit, as I said in the beginning of this video, of shopping on there. 
Um, I love their foods and snacks. <laughs> uh, comment below and if you'd like to see more iHerb snack hauls, food hauls, some of my iHerb I heard favorites as far as healthy snacks. I would love to share that with you guys. Um, but yeah, comment below. I know many of you um, have found iHerb through me. And so comment below on what skincare products you buy on iHerb. If, if one wasn't mentioned, share in the comments below what it is that you're using and loving. Um, but like I said, I really love shopping on iHerb genuinely. Um, and I encourage you to check the description box. I will list all of these products down below um, on iHerb. And uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends. And as always, don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.